Hi guys, today I'd quickly like to share with you something I discovered on Denuke SE, the public version of Denuke, earlier on this week. So basically what I was doing was I was looking around on the map for some corners that we could possibly utilize to our advantage and I was wondering whether we could use these spots like for example here or on top of this roof or anywhere else for that matter. So as you can see I've turned on no clip and I was wondering whether we could actually stack to these spots was there any possible way to boost up so I started from the top down instead of from the bottom up and as you can see I am currently standing on some invisible ceiling but I'm also able to stack here so what this means is if I were to go from bottom up I would also hit the ceiling it's actually called an invisible skybox and as you can see I can also not progress to the other side of the map because apparently there's also a vertical skybox somewhere around here that's blocking my path so I was wondering again whether there could be any possible way to access this ceiling or what we call in uh, 1.6 as skybox walking so as I was walking about the map uh, the ceiling stretched for just about everywhere until I stood around here and then it happened and then I fell so I realized there must be a gap in the skybox ceiling right around here so I was searching through some commands to reveal the skybox gap and what I found was this interesting command I think it's called Hold on, if I can recall clearly, it's called draw clip brushes number two. And there we are. The skybox gap appears, followed by also revealing the skybox itself. And as you can see, the map looks quite different now, as there are skyboxes all over the place telling you where you can go and where you cannot go. Alright, so. I was watching this video and I discovered that people have actually successfully stacked on top of this roof and whoops sorry not this roof if you do if you do stack if you do stack here I don't think you can progress anywhere else but if you manage to stack here yep right around here and by the way if you were to flash boost you can probably reach this area flash boosting means that you basically stand on top of teammate and the teammate underneath you throws a flash and then you can stack on the flash up towards here so without any other delay let us see where we can and cannot go as as you can see this was the invisible skybox which is now quite visible and of course this platform that you can utilize so if you do manage to stack up here not only will you be able to peep around the corner hold on let me turn off the clip boxes I'll draw clip boxes number zero all right and there we go so right now we have successfully assuming we have successfully stacked from here all the way up to here and then well the possibilities are endless basically this is only one of the many spots that you can stack and of course if you're hiding behind this pillar I don't think you'd be visible um, one more other good place to stack that I've discovered yeah, is that if you manage to get onto this roof you can just walk right down here and make a quick jump to this fence try not to injure yourself too much walk all the way to here and notice this big oil drum over here you can stand inside the oil drum now this is incredibly buggy because if you stand inside the oil drum you're invisible yes nobody can see you nobody can see you at all so I was wondering whether this can deal full damage from the inside out or not and so I decided to place some dummy bots right around here and then I tested it when I stood inside this oil tanker which I'm completely invisible I could deal full damage to anybody so there we are advantage number one of discovering skyboxes is that you can stack unbelievably far make around make a walk around the far side of the map and come all around here all right speaking of the far side of the map I think it's also possible for you to end up here and if you're a good opera 
good sniper, I mean, you can op anybody from around here. And I'm not sure whether this penetrates or not, but I'm pretty sure if you stand out here, yes, it is completely penetrable. Alright, and not to mention that people won't look there. It, it's impossible. Nobody will actually look there and turn their heads and say, oh, there could be somebody camping over here. And last but not least, I would also like to mention this spot that I discovered to be quite interesting. Now, not only that this spot is more accessible than those two other spots that I just showed you, but it's also easier to get to. Well, that's the same as accessibility, but who cares? Alright, so if you stand right around here, um, one thing I discovered is that is also a gap in the skyboxes here. Not that it's accessible from our side of the map, but you want to be careful because you don't want to fall down here underneath the fence. Because once you're there, there is no possible way that you can climb up here. So what I did was just jump across the gap, position yourself here, and you can completely guard outers. Now if this was the official version of Denuke, Denuke VE, where it's played in tournaments, outer would be of much greater importance than now because outer terrorists can access outer too um, there is a underpass that leads all the way to b site so if you're here let's say let me place a dummy bot right here yeah see and if i were to fly all the way there let's say i'm a terrorist that i'm pushing here all right in the clear. i would most certainly not be checking here. What I would be checking is either here, inside the underpass itself, or on rafters. This is rafters by the way, this is crow's nest and this is rafters. So those are the most possible spots to go out there, but nobody will actually check here. And in fact, it's impossible to see, let's say with a rifle or pistol, it's impossible to see. The only way you can check here is with a scope. And let me show you just how effective this spot is. So let's say I was standing in his position. I would just scope right here and... And there we go. So I think that's all I have to share with you guys now. I, I hope you've enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Stay close.